Hello folks, uh, it's Ron back with uh, Ron's Drone Channel and today I have a video about uh, one of my favorite drones of the past year or so, the Altel Evo 2 Pro. And I don't do enough videos on this thing. Uh, I really love this drone, love the camera in it and uh, again, I, I just don't do enough videos on it. So what I got for you today is I got a test of the Altel, uh, yeah, the Altel Evo 2 Pro's zoom feature. Now, um, what, I, what I did is I shot the video in 4K 30 frames per second and uh, I flew it out towards some kind of rig out in the ocean off the shore here in Margate City, New Jersey. As, fly, as I was slowly flying towards it, I kept zooming in, you know, one factor higher at a time. And um, actually, I started at 2x. I, you know, when I first take off, I'm in 2x, not 1x, because I was, you know, just zoomed in because I wanted everything a little bit closer in this video. So um, I want you to see the progression of, I've gone, th I go through, you know, 2x, 3x, 4x, 5x, and 6x. And um, you know, uh, at the 2x one, it, you know, it looks um, like there's no. Um, it looks totally lossless at that point. It doesn't look like there's any um, kind of digital noise or artifacts you would see from uh, from digital zooming. But when you get up to the final one, six, you can definitely see some, um, you know, some digital artifacts from the, you know, zooming in beyond uh, what is capable of. Um, so the, the key is uh, in the middle there between two and six, like w what's your top stop of um, you lost a zoom or whatever. So I'm gonna just let, you know, just gonna roll the video and let you guys watch it and see what you think about uh, each step of the zoom process, you know, going from two to six as I'm flying out towards this uh, boat in the, you know, blue water on a kind of a perfect sunny day. So. Hey folks, that was my test of the zoom on the Evo 2 Pro. Um, you know, if you if you you know took your um, settings down to the 1080p at 30 or maybe any frame rate, you you would get even more stops of loss of zoom. Uh, you know, the more we lower it down, and uh, probably if I put it up at the uh, the 6K, it would probably be. Um, you know, maybe less stops of uh, a digital zoom and, you know, everything along with 2.7 would be better. So if you, if you really wanted to really zoom in on something and you didn't really care about it being 4K, you could just bump it down uh, a little bit and, and increase it. So just a little power tip for you. Okay, so I'm going to try to do more videos on the Altel Evo 2 Pro, which is a little bit more affordable now. Uh, you see it you know, you see the uh, 8K one, you know, maybe going for, you know, somewhere around 1000 1100 on sale. And for a couple hundred dollars more, maybe around 1199 1200 you see the Evo 2 uh, Pro. So that's a great price for the drone, really, the, for the camera, the 40-minute battery life, uh, the 360 obstacle avoidance, just to name some of the, the highlight features of it. So, and I did get a little bit of news today. Um, Altel sent an email out to like, kind of like dealers, most like like uh, I, I got a forward to me from DroneWorks, but apparently due to a chip shortage, the Evo 2 Pro, the, the, as as we currently know, it, will cease production production soon, and it will work on a version two uh, of this drone, apparently with a different chip, you know, than, than the first one. So you know, early days for that news or whatever. Hopefully, we get more information uh, to file, but uh, you know, just 
for the, for that information, make sure you uh, let you know, put a, hit a thumbs up if you like the video. Uh, uh, bring that bell notification button, you know, so you'll be notified uh, whenever I post a new video. And of course, I think I forgot to say subscribe to the channel. You know, I can always use a couple extra yeah, subscribers around here, you know, so I can get my numbers up. Uh, so, all right, folks, thanks for stopping by the channel, and we will see you on the next one.